finally getting a break from the rain as you take a live look across downtown Fort Wayne as the, we're seeing some breaks in the clouds earlier this morning. We had a few bit of light showers here and there, but now we're on the dry side with partly cloudy skies. And if you're trying to make any plans, maybe if you're going to church this morning or you want any outdoor plans, here's what the future track shows. Again, we're going to see some clouds this morning, but that will slowly begin to clear out, leaving us with some sunshine this afternoon. So if you want any outdoor activities, it's going to be a nice day to do so. Maybe a few stray showers off towards our southwest, but overall we should be more on the dry side, which is a good thing because rainfall total so far, just for the month of July, we see we saw almost about five inches of rainfall. We're only halfway through the month and so far we're about 2.8 inches above normal. To put that in perspective, we saw about two months of rainfall in just this month so far. And then looking at the year total so far, we saw just a little under about 25 inches of rain. So we're still above normal for a rainfall. Most of it came from Friday evening. But the good news is we're going to have a brief dry period, some relief from all the rain, as we're going to be dry from today all the way until about Thursday. And let me show you why. So this is the surface weather map. So looking off towards our east, there's that low pressure system that dropped all that rainfall into uh, Friday night into early Saturday morning. That's bringing some rain showers across the northeast. But now we have this high pressure system uh, building over Wisconsin. And what that's going to do is going to bring drier air from the northeast, all that humidity the humidity that we saw the past couple of days is going to push all that moisture out of our region. So we will be a little bit more comfortable uh, starting today and that high will remain over the Midwest. So this will keep us sunny not only for uh, this afternoon, but also for Monday, Tuesday, and it'll keep us dry for most of the work week. So weather headlines for the next few days ahead. Like I mentioned, sunshine is back, staying dry and also warm weather will be coming back. So current temperatures we are into the uh, mid to upper 60s, 64 degrees in Auburn and Van Wert, 67 here in Fort Wayne. A little bit cooler off towards our west at 63 degrees into Warsaw. We're expecting our highs to reach into the low 80s this afternoon, so we will be right around uh, below average. But the, comparing temperatures the last three days, again, Thursday was on the warm side, but then we dropped down the 70s into Friday and we just reached 80 degrees yesterday, but we do have warmer temperatures on the way. S starting today, we'll see a little bit warmer trend. Mid 80s will be back for Monday and even into Tuesday. We'll stay around the normal mark for the rest of the week. But just to recap what today looks like, we'll see mostly sunny skies, highs reaching into the low 80s. But since our winds are coming out from the northeast, we're going to be less humid compared to the past few days. And as we get towards the overnight hours, we'll stay quiet, mostly clear skies with lows cooling down into the low 60s and then looking at your extended forecast again next three days dry plenty of sunshine blue skies much warmer temperatures uh, into the mid 80s for Monday and Tuesday and then for Wednesday and Thursday brought the cloudy skies temperatures around the normal mark around the low to mid 80s and as we get towards by the end of the week for Friday and Saturday We'll see storm chances return the forecast, but for now, we will be dry for quite some time. You know, this is that kind of weather type Got of your dance. happy dance You going. have to do the happy dance when you have this type of weather. You know, it's so good after all of this rain to be able to finally just get that sunshine. And also the warmer temperatures as well. So people that want to go to the pools, yeah. especially the kiddos, you know, the past couple days have just been rainy. Yeah. You know, you just want to take them outside and go in the pool. You can't beat that. Most definitely. Thank you for that full forecast, Matthew. We're feeling that it's a little Christmas in July, actually. Regardless of the temperatures, we'll show you a family of Christmas tree farmers who gets ready to deck the halls in the months in advance.